Hello and welcome to Blythe Red Business News, where today I'm joined by Jay Cheatham, Chief Executive, and Bob Rosenthal, Technical Director of Pantheon Resources. Pantheon, listed in London uh, on the AIM market, a market capitalization of around £265 million sterling, and operating on the North Slope in Alaska. Now, gentlemen, welcome back on the programme. You've just announced the spudding of the Megrez 1. Uh, Tell us about the reservoir you're targeting there and the resource potential. And Bob, I'm going to come to you for this one, please, first. So what, tell us about the reservoir. Tell us about the resource potential. Well, thanks, Tim. Uh, first, <laughs> we're, we're, we're drilling in a very exciting target here. Uh, we're looking at about 600 million barrels of uh, hydrocarbon liquids and about 3.3 TCF of uh, gas. That's a... That's a huge target. That's like a billion barrels of oil equivalent uh, that we're testing here. The important thing to remember about this is the reservoir we're targeting here is the best reservoir we have seen on our acreage. We're looking at something that is possibly three orders of magnitude better than we've already tested at Alk2. It's uh, better than the reservoir that we've seen over at the top sets at uh, uh, Apun, Apun West. And in comparison, even there, we're looking at 10 to 20 times better than the, the reservoir we're, we're seeing there. So we're looking at something that's between 20 and 25% porosity. And, and we're looking at more importantly, permeabilities that are five to 35 millidarcies. It's a, excellent conventional reservoir. Okay. So we're very excited by it. Uh, Jay, let me come to you now. I mean, just talk us through how the drill program, how the drill campaign is going to unfold. Okay, Tim. Well, we're drilling from a gravel pad on the west side of the Dalton Highway. This target is on the east side of the Dalton Highway, so it will be a deviated well. It won't be a highly deviated well. Uh, not by our current standards, where you, you get some very, very high angle wells. Uh, we will enter the reservoir uh, deviated. Um, however, it's not a difficult well. Uh, we're going to take some cores. Uh, we're going to do full suites of logs. One of the changes that we've initiated in, in this well uh, versus some of the others is we're going to use oil-based mud and that will reduce the torque and, and, the, and, and the drag uh, on the drill pipe. And you can imagine in a deviated well, I mean, it's gonna wanna lay on, the, on that bottom side of the, of the hole. So the oil-based mud uh, uh, will uh, allow us to reduce that torque and drag. And, and we've modeled this well extensively with, uh, with SLB or Schlumberger and uh, we're ready for, for the drilling of this well, Tim. Yeah. Well, I was, I was going to ask you, Jay, because you know, the, of the potential significance of Megrez 1, what kind of planning uh, did you carry out in advance of actual operations commencing? Yeah, so yes. So with Schlumberger, we ran many, many models, uh, depending on exactly where uh, we ended up with our bottom hole location, uh, different angles, you know, inclinations, et cetera. To, to literally just model the well from top to bottom once we come out of the surface casing, which you know we'll look for a shale somewhere around 3,500 feet or thereabouts for our surface casing. And then we'll come out and start deviating the well. And we've, we've, we've modeled it, we've modeled taking the cores. Uh, so we're ready. Okay, final question, gentlemen. I'm gonna to come to you, Jay, for this one. Look, I don't, we don't wanna get ahead of ourselves, but what does the outcome uh, of the Megrez One well mean for Pantheon's portfolio as a whole? Well, Bob explained it in, in, in so well. We're looking at reservoir properties that are 10 to 20 times better than anything we've seen elsewhere uh, in our portfolio. If the Megrez well comes in at, on prognosis, then we will shift our development from the Apun eastern top sets, I mean, western top sets to the Apun eastern top sets on the east side of the Dalton Highway because that's where the best reservoir is. And of course, that's, 
that's where we would want to start our development with the best wells in our portfolio uh, and drilling from along the Dalton Highway on on gravel uh, along there. So it it uh, it's so exciting, Tim. I just can't I can't emphasize that enough. We just we're just so happy that we're uh, uh, we're in operations again. Okay, thanks for that, Jay. Uh, Bob, is there anything you want to add on what this might mean for the portfolio? Yes, you know, I just wanted to add one thing. You know, this is this is a well I've been waiting to drill for a long time. It's, it, you know, it's huge prospect. And we're, we're looking at something that, you know, has a probability of success of about 70% and the target 600 million barrels and three TCF of gas, you know, there's not a lot of times in your career you get to drill a prospect like this. So I just wanted to say that for, for the, for the audience. Yeah. Thanks, Bob. Exciting times. Congratulations on the spudding, gentlemen. Do come back and keep us informed on progress. That was the team from Pantheon Resources giving us a very quick update on what's happening on the North Slope of Alaska, the Apoon Field in the Megrez one spudding. And that's it for this edition of Blythe Business News. Thanks for watching.